he was a great guy, and, and he's going to be missed by a lot of people. So we love him a lot. The Terre Haute community is sharing its memories of a beloved firefighter. Good evening and thanks for joining us. The COVID-19 pandemic continues to take lives around the country, including right here in the Wabash Valley. Firefighter John Schofstall lost his battle to COVID-19 yesterday morning. Tonight, the community is remembering his life and legacy. At 5 o'clock, you heard from the captain of Fire Station 5. That's where Schofstall worked. In our top story tonight, News 10's Richard Solomon has more from one of his brothers in the department. This sign you're reading says, please keep Terre Haute Fire Department family in your prayers. That's after firefighter John Schofstall died Sunday in the line of duty. He spent majority of his time here at Station 5 in downtown Terre Haute. And some I spoke with say they're choosing to remember the wonderful times they shared with him. The sun is shining in Terre Haute, but a gloomy cloud hovers over Fire Station 5. Firefighter John Schofstall battled fires for nearly 12 years, but on Sunday, he lost his battle to COVID-19. One of John's closest friends and fellow firefighter Floyd Mason says he's choosing to think about the laughs the two shared. Oh man, he's funny and he laughed all the time. You never caught him in a bad mood and, he, and everybody loved John and you wouldn't find anyone that could say anything bad about him. Mason told me he's known John since he was 16. The two went to school together and worked right here at Station 5. Mason says you can always find John in his favorite place. He was a good cook, but we were all taking a walk and and we said, you know about this time is when John would start heating some oil up because we always have fried chicken on Sunday afternoon. And but Sundays and every day from now on will be a little dimmer without John's light. This is video just hours after his death. The community and first responders watched in silence as John's body was escorted through town. Others said their last goodbyes. Mason says his friend lived an honorable life. He worked right up to the last and he, he went out a true hero doing, doing what he does best. Now I have been in contact with Fire Department Chief Jeff Fisher. He says right now the family and department are planning services for John. Fisher says they do plan to send him off the right way. Reporting in downtown Terre Haute, Richard Solomon, News 10.